but unfortunately he didn't. He finished second with 33 votes, but because of the suspension against Carlton with the brutal tackle against Matty Cruiser, he couldn't win the Brownlow anyway. But that season, statistically, Patrick Dangerfoot was far better than the season before. He kicked 45 goals, over 140 tackles, 430 contested possessions. There's danger there. Well, use some high possession and work your oh, way through the group. He didn't take the mark. Skate right now for the Demons. They're swarming. Oh, the no. left boot of Patrick Dangerfield. Oh. Link run. Dangerfield from 52. Winds up on the left and kicks a ripper. I'm going to ask you again, boys. I'm going to ask you again. Sort of half back into it. Or can he do it again? Yeah, he can. He's kicked three. He's up here. So Zach. Yes. There's Dangerfield away from the stoppage. This one will nearly get over the head of Hawkins. I don't think he touched it. This quarter, Jenkins, McKay, oh, or Dangerfield oh. just... And in the end, he doesn't go for goal. He kicks it to... Pat. Passes on to him. Dangerfield sweeps and swoops and goals. Three. Oh, he's a fierce tackler. 55 from home. It's coming back. It's oh. coming back. And it is back. And so... Caps actually down the middle. Dangerfield, great mark. What about that? To that release. And hard. Mark taken by Selwood. Handballs off. Dangerfield. Dangerfield. Oh, yes, he does. The top. High footy. Jack Rewald can't get a jump in. What a great mark. Dangerfield going back. Views around the body, oh he's got it again! But unfortunately the story stayed the same where he led Geelong only to a prelim final, losing to a team led by a man in yellow and black. And that 2017 season was headlined by a man in yellow and black. The neck tats, the sleeves, arguably the biggest name of footy, Dustin Martin. <laughs> 2017, Dustin Martin had the greatest season he could ever predict. Statistically, he was as good as any other player. But in terms of the eye test, he was more than just unstoppable. His brute strength mean you couldn't get near him, and if you try to tackle him, he'd put that mid out and fend you off. He had a new meaning to explosive. He would get the ball, sprint past five players, burst through three players, break another two tackles, and then kick some ridiculous goal in the biggest moment of the biggest game of the year. He didn't care about the small games. He was a big game player. Now that year, Dustin Martin broke the record Brownlow votes that Danger had broken, polling 36 votes and a record 11 best on grounds. To this day that 36 votes has not been broken, only drawn by a man I'll talk about a bit later. Now Dustin Martin not only won the Brownlow that year, but he's the only player on this list to win the Premiership. And he did so in emphatic style, being the best on ground that game, winning the Norm Smith medal. Now no player has ever won the Brownlow and the Norm Smith medal, and who knows if anyone ever will. That's how good Dustin Martin was. He won every award you could win that season. The Wayu 